Hello everybody and welcome to another third party review. In today's video, thanks to the team over at Shozy, we're taking a look at the latest offering from New Age. Now, there are multiple companies giving us these legend scale figures, and I have to admit, with the likes of Magic Squared, DX9, Unique Toys, Iron Factory, I think New Age are the best there is. Uh, they have given us mini masterpiece figures. These are absolutely incredible and at a tiny little scale. Now this is of course their take on Cosmos. The previous figure I had from them was their Bumblebee. They've also released multiple repaints of him including a gold bug repaint. Here is Bumblebee alongside Cosmos. As you can see they are very similar size. I just absolutely adore the levels of detailing on Cosmos. I mean his head uh, it's tiny but he's absolutely nailed it. He's got those really bold piercing blue eyes. Yes he's only got like ball jointed mounts on his shoulders and on his elbows etc but do we really need anything other than that? I think he ticks a lot of boxes. He is basically a smaller version of the X Transbot Cosmos. It's kind of a cross up between that and the Toy World one, and it is outstanding. Backpack isn't overly horrendous, it's nothing out of the ordinary. Articulation is really nice, some really good range on there, lots of Ball mounts, there's waist rotation, legs that can come this far forwards and this far back, out to the side, upper knee rotation. There's a rotation on the foot there, we've got some pivot left and right, so he's a very poseable little unidentified flying object. Now he does come with his tractor beam as well, which is in three separate pieces. We have the pegging system at the top, and then we have two of these components. And I think he is superb. Uh, I've just seen pictures of their soon to be released Prowl as well. They cannot go wrong. As much as I love his classic green, he's also available in this very nice blue. I believe this is uh, based on the Diaclone appearance. Uh, again, he comes with his cow catcher, but this time it's done in the clear translucent. And for a quick scale comparison, here he is alongside the Magic Square Blaster, the DX9, Optimus Prime, and of course the New Age Bumblebee. I would really like to see how these scale with the MMC Skylinks as well. I think they'd look exceptional together. Now as awesome as Cosmos looks like this, he does of course transform. We can bend his feet down, and we're going to tab those in nice and tight together. Uh, I recommend you turning the waist just so you can gain access to this crotch flap which needs to be pulled down. Lift this back panel up so the waist can be completely rotated. This chest piece then comes untabbed like so and from this position rock this back on a ball jointed hinge and with this rocked back you want to rotate it all the way around these green pieces fold outwards on that hinge and then the arms just come down to the side. So again on this side rotate this hinge outwards like so. Push down on these edge pieces which lift these panel sections up. Again on this side you want to push down so that this piece here comes up, uh, rotate the head. Now bear in mind I don't have any instructions with these so if I make an error with one of my steps or it's slightly different to your production instructions then please follow them. I am kind of guessing my way <laughs> around it. Uh, you want to rotate this around, that's going to push and tab in on either side like so. Uh, the arms are then going to push and tab in and push and 
tab in like that, the fists can rotate like this. And then making sure that these two tabs tab in on the front there, push and collapse those shoulders and then bring this tailgate section around. And there we have Cosmos in his little UFO mode. Now, you can keep this piece on him at all times if you see fit. Uh, these will only fit like so. There we go, there's his little UFO piece on the bottom and then we can just tab that in like that. There we have him hovering around abducting small animals. And here they are fully transformed up alongside Prime. Uh, they're a little bit too big to get him in his trailer, but that is exceptional. Tidies up really nicely, very solid piece. And definitely the best legend scale plastic that I've experienced probably even better than their bumblebee which in itself was leaps and bounds better than most of the competition these are great value for money and i honestly cannot wait to see what else new age do uh, they are by far my favorite and leaders of these mini masterpiece figures thanks again to show z for making these reviews possible i've included a link in the description below where these can be ordered and until next time for myself and cosmos one and cosmos two thanks for watching goodbye